As a photographer, sometimes your clients might want you to do certain special effects to their photos, uh, whether it's for a family album or some kind of event like a wedding, or you may just want to know a technique to create kind of a photo collage uh, just for your own personal use on a social networking site, for example. Um, so here's a quick technique to create a photo collage in Photoshop. Go ahead and open up photos you want to use, and make sure you can see the rulers. If you can't, just go to View, then Rulers. Click and drag off the edge. You just want to divide this in third, but I'm not going to really measure it. I mean, you can divide that by three and then figure out exactly where a third is, but I'm just going to do kind of close. Use the Move tool if you want to move them around a little bit. I'm going to do something like that. Mine aren't going to be evenly spaced because I don't want one going across the middle of the individual there. Um, you can create yours in like 2 by 3 format depending on the photo make sure you just have the background layer here and go ahead and select the marquee selection tool rectangular marquee selection tool on the toolbar just go ahead and make a selection out like so if you want it to snap to the ruler guides there you can just go to view then snap to guides and make sure that's checked I don't really need it to I'm just kinda seeing where they can overlap a little bit for this example so I'm actually going to overlap a little bit and just press Control J on the PC, Command J on the Mac this is very important, go ahead and click make sure you're back on the background layer and go ahead and click the next area Control J, make sure you click back on the background layer do this one over here Control J again or Command J and do this one here and then finally I'm just going to do one large one over here like so All right. now uh, choose one of these and go to layer and then we're gonna go to layer style and then stroke just gonna add a little bit of a border in this example um, see I'm gonna drag this to the top first so I can see it Right. So you can set, kind of see it right there. Um, I'm going to probably do on this example 5 pixels or maybe something like that, 4 or 5. And then also choose drop shadow. And we're going to want a, I'm just going to set to normal and then black color. And you can kind of see the distance. Well, this one you can't see it because it's not. I uh, need to resize it a little bit, but distance shouldn't be too much. I'm going to probably do 5 pixels and a size 5 pixels. I'm just going to hit OK. And move this around so you can kind of see what we're working with here. All right. Now what you want to do is just kind of uh, hold down Alt on the PC or Option on the Mac. And over on the layers palette, you're just going to click and drag that effect right there where it says effects, not just drop shadow or just stroke, but just where it says effects. And drag that to, click and drag that to all the other layers. So hold down Alt or Option, click and drag that. So now all of them have the same exact effect. All right. Then click on each one, select the Move tool, make sure you have Show Transform Controls selected up there. And you're just going to... tilt that just a little bit. If you go off to the edge there, the corner where it's a double sided arrow and just press enter to apply that change. You can do that to all these. Just you know, tilt some to the left, some to the right. Like so. And the last one right here. Should do that one just a little bit. All right. Last thing is background layer. Just click the eye icon, create a new layer, and drag it below all the other ones except the background, and choose some kind of color. You could pull it for the foreground color. You could pull it from the photo if you want, um, or you can just select one that you think matches. Press Alt Backspace on the PC or Option Delete on the Mac. That will fill that bottom layer. And then we have a nice collage look.
All right, and you can move these around if you want to adjust them a little bit. You can resize them uh, for that kind of almost look like a bunch of photos are thrown around and some on top of each other. If you want some on top, obviously just click and drag them over the other layers in the layers palette for a specific look. All right, so that's how you create a quick photo collage with a slight drop shadow and stroke on specific uh, photos so you kind of have this look that a bunch of photos thrown out onto a table using Adobe Photoshop. Thanks.